Well, another day, another dollar. Well, spend anyway. <laughs> it's only a dollar as well. Right, I felt a bit cheated about this. I mean, boat job and this lock. So what I'm going to attempt to do is I'll use this bit of box section and I'll try and make a barge out of it, a steel barge, just a small one. And it might, and it is a might, work a bit better than before. So we'll make a start. I'm not making this too long, but I, I really wanted to show making this as part of the whole project. And it didn't work, did it? So I'm just going to make a start, and it'll be short. But I'm pretty short this video is. And well, this part of the video, I should say. So all I'm going to do, I've got to put it in two to start with. That's the first thing. So I've got to run the grinder down this seam. We'll see how we go on. Right, I've got my metal cut up to make the main hull anyway. So I just ground it up rough. It won't matter because I've hopefully I've still got if I can find it and it ain't gone off. I've got a bit of bitumen so I can paint it black, can't I? That'll it'll look the part then. Anyway, next thing is now I've got to stick this together. All right, that's how I like working metal. It's far easier to stick together isn't it? Right, we'll do that. I'll just show you the start of it. Right, we'll just have a go at sticking this together. I'm just going to tack it up first. I'm not showing you hours of welding because it's boring. But, just to show you that uh, it shouldn't be tipped too long, hopefully. We've got it together, you see. I'll just weld it up now. Well, I've got my barge made. And it's come alright. <coughs> it's come not bad at all, actually. Anyway, it's too heavy. So, I'm going to, to grind it quite a lot thinner on most of it along there. So we'll do that. Hello. Well, I think we've got one more video in this. Right, I made a steel barge. Right? I'll show you a tiny bit, a quick bit of video making it. And I've got some more animals because I've got a horse. One of my mates said, oh, he said, authentic malt says, using a dinosaur when well, it's right, isn't he? So we've got a horse. Um, I've done a better road system. You see, I've just uh, had that bit of uh, stainless and the whole top, top out and I've got a piece of pipe, you can't quite see it in there I don't think, I got in the bottom and I had to put a piece of wood on the top to stop it tipping up. Anyway, it appears it might work. So we're going to give it a go anyway. Now, to make it more authentic as well, I'll open the paddle because I've made sure it opens fully. Um, I've made the hole bigger so it'll fill faster right because I don't want it to be too long and I put pump in the bottom so as long as the pump keeps working we're going to fill it up to the top I've also just taped this lock up to hopefully stop it leaking too much so we'll see how it goes right so that's the plan <laughs> it never works does it <laughs> all right We'll give it a go.
Right, I'm right in the way of the car. I'll go around the back of it this time. So you can see, you haven't missed though, have you? It's only filling up the water. But look at that, pouring in. So, that's an improvement. Now will the boat float? That's another thing. Well, it's not taking that long, is it? It's worked so far. Better not overload the pump. Look at that, it's going up fast. As long as this pump just keeps going a little bit longer. I might make it. level so I'll open the gate oh by the way I put a hinge on it as well that's right, stuck I anyway, put proper hinge on right let's see if the road system works any better than before because a little bit jumpy yet because we're not don't think we're quite afloat but this is what happens sometimes the boating it doesn't always uh, you sometimes scrape the bottom and scrape the sill. But the road system's working, look into it this time. Whoa! Giddy up! See, you have a horse rather than a dinosaur. Now, is it got nose dive in the lock though? And sink it. That's a bit of a worry actually. We're very close to the top. We'll see. Might just have to give it a tiny bit of a helping hand here. Yeah, just lift it up a fraction. Well, there we are, look, floating in the lock now. Anyway, it's not totally authentic again, but I'm sure you'll agree that's a bit better than it was. The road system's better, still needs some improvement, but we've got a proper steel barge. And had the animals been in, you know, just to show you that, let me put the animals in. Better even them out, aren't they? I don't like capsizing. 
Where's the rest of them? There we are. Right. You see, so we've got a load of animals and I should have left them in, I didn't realise. So there we are. You know, I would say that's fairly successful, if I'm honest. That's fairly successful. Yeah? Fairly successful. Oh! Blooming dinosaur! Again! Stuck its head over the side and drowned all the animals and sunk the boat. They all rushed to one side. Dear, oh dear. Oh, right. I better go and save all the animals from drowning and uh, go and get a pump organised and, and get the blooming... and get the uh, boat lifted. Right. <laughs> Well, it didn't all go absolutely perfect, did it? But it, you've got to agree it was better than the first attempt. All right. And I've made me steel narrowboat. And I've not been cheated. So there we are. What it is, the water's gone in this bottom uh, pound. It's still leaked through the gate. That's where the water's gone. Otherwise, it would have floated in nicely. All right. See ya.